What up, it's Kickapoo Twist, back with another video. Um, so, my phone is like acting real funny. Uh, I can't make my videos too long right now. You know, plus there's a lot of forces working against me. They don't want me to share, but I'm, I'm still gonna say what the fuck I gotta say. Um, but I'm going to do some shorter videos and I'm going to start like freestyling this because I feel like I'm mastering this. I'm definitely leveling up. I can feel me leveling up. So, oh yeah. <laughs> Look, I almost missed my hip hop queen, Queen Latifah. Love her. She's, I love her. Like, respect. This is, um, she's from New Jersey. Came out in 93. She kind of set the tone for like female strength, being strong. Like you could be sexy and strong. You know what I'm saying? Definitely uh, respect is earned. Let me see what the book. I like reading the book. Some people don't. I It helps me to, to look deeper into things. I'm trying to see the bigger picture. So, um principles resolve hard-headedness and fight definitely uh i know myself i can be hard-headed and when i have something like set in my mind like i'm someone i know what i want at this point i know what i want i'm going to get what i want and if things ain't falling into place with what i want and what i need then um it's just getting cut point blank fight yeah okay so it talks about you and i t y unity ladies first ladies first it says she educated the masses all while standing maintaining her title of queen but it says she is more than just the sum of her parts. Every element of this supreme being commands our attention. It's just another day in the life of a legend. Okay. I like that. And it says, think like, think like the queen on this car. Hold your chin up. Straighten your crown. The rest will fall into place. Yeah, because you respect yourself. You set standards for yourself. It's like everything else falls into place. Like when you're an honest individual, when you're trying to, you know, you're, you're trying to learn from your mistakes. You're trying to grow. You're trying to expand. You're trying to open your mind. Uh, people that are closed-minded, stuck, people that are liars, they're not going to really get along with you too good. And that's, you got to realize that. Stop trying to force yourself to like be with people that, are not on the same vibration as you. Some people you're gonna outgrow. Everybody is not gonna learn from the their mistakes. Everybody is not going to level up. Like so, you know, but somebody uh and this is like me reading my energy. So if it's not my own energy, it's somebody that's in my energy somebody is whoever's talking about you whoever's thinking about you whoever's watching you um if somebody's watching me uh it could be i'm picking up on their energy like i'm very intuitive i'm peeping shit out but somebody want to confess and come clean and turn over a new leaf um because of their guilty conscience Okay. I'm not going to make these like more than 10 minutes. The hair font. This is tradition. This might be somebody married or in a commitment. Um, it's kind of like conformity. I mean, this, this hair font can, can be read like several different ways. Um, but in this situation, I feel like this is somebody that's like been conforming to the pattern like stuck in a pattern and stuck in the way that they believe 
You know what I mean? When they need to like cut off, probably change their way of thinking. Um, and if they want to confess or come clean, then whatever like contract that they're bound to, they probably need to get out of this contract. They probably need to do something different because uh, you're binding, it, whoever this is, is binding themselves to a, a fucked up situation. Okay, light at the end, or, end of the tunnel. Recover, improve. Yeah, let it go. Like, whatever this is binding you, that's bringing you nothing positive, it's not doing nothing for you, uh, let it go. Gosh. Magician. <laughs> this is a smooth talker. The magician can be good, but it can also be somebody that like has the gift of gab, a smooth operator, thinks they can charm their way out of anything. But when you're dealing with this type of energy, that shit is not ever going to fly. Somebody that's tapped in and intuitive. Judgment, yeah. If you keep trying to play around and play games and like not be your authentic self, it's like uh, you're going to go through judgment. Like This is also about awakening. So maybe... With there being light at the end of a tunnel, maybe somebody's realizing that, um, or they're going through an awakening, having a breakthrough. It's time to self-evaluate. Like, look at what the fuck you're doing wrong. Evaluate the people around you in your circle. Evaluate uh, what you need to change. Yeah, um, independence and free yourself from this baggage. Unrequited love. Yeah, because whatever situation, this contract or whatever, this is unrequited love. This is heartbreak. This uh, is manipulation. Uh, probably a lot of one night stands, cheating, and then you're probably also because that's that's what you're going to attract if that's the type of person that you are you're only going to be running into like other cheaters and heartbreakers and manipulators so mm -hmm. whoever energy this is they need, you need to let it go man yeah this is the empress and the Empress, this is like every queen in the deck and it's upright. So maybe um, in order to get into the energy of someone like this, you're going to have to um, put in the work. Yeah, this is somebody nurturing, creative, beautiful, feminine, artistic, sensual. This is like every queen, every woman. So, um, changes got to get made. Oh, yeah, you got to be vulnerable, um, quit doubting yourself, feeling inadequate because you are adequate. You can be, but it takes work. Just remember anything that you don't really have to work for, is it really worth having? Whether it's easy money, easy bitches, um, when it comes that easy, it's, it's like you're not, you can appreciate something way more, you know, uh, when you work for it and when you quit being childish. And then we got arrogant and reckless on top of that. So whatever energy this is, like they want a partnership, they want a connection that's real, but your arrogance is holding you back reckless daredevil overly confident loud show off and these is probably the type of women that you're attracting and you're not liking it 
you want to be back into this empress energy but um yeah this is equality somebody that's going to give to you equally but you got to remember hoes like money hoes don't care about uh feelings they they want money they want a quick come up they want to hand out when you're dealing with this empress energy you have to meet this person emotionally this person this somebody that's nurturing they need they want someone to nurture them emotionally be there physically you got to put in some time okay and that's just that's the truth because here it says attraction marriage soulmates potential compatibility um yeah something real so um, whatever energy this is, uh, yeah, you, you need to put in the work. So uh, I'm going to get a few. Matter of fact, I'm going to do a few songs and then I'm going to move on to another short video. And, I, and hopefully this will resonate with somebody that watches it because I'm just like freestyling this shit. Boss Nova. Yeah. So you must you you must want want that empress whoever this is cuz she a boss and you're not used to that you're used to dealing with all these hoes they be so thirsty and they're materialistic and it's kind of like a shocking to you that there's actually a woman that just really doesn't want you for any anything material like they just really want you so it's time for you to match their energy. Match their energy, man. <clears throat> yeah, give her a reason to stay here. <clears throat> give her a reason. How's the song go? My voice ain't up to par right now. I've been sick, but it's like, give me one reason to stay here. And I'll turn right back around. You got to give her a reason. Show up and show out. Get one more song. My sound been cutting off and shit. So, um. Probably been going back and forth with this person. I saw back and forth. How you going to act like that? You know why. You know why they're acting like that. And you know what you got to do. Because in this song, Tyree's like, boy, you know why the fuck she acting like that. Quit playing. You know what you got to do. Chival chivalry is not dead. And more of you dudes need to start being more chivalrous. Run, come in here like Prince Charming. Come in here with the flowers and the chocolate. Sweep somebody off their feet. You're so used to dealing with these hoes. They're easily impressed. Switch it up. Get what you want. Holler at your girl. I'll be back.